Okay, guys, this is a story time on my first boyfriend. On my first boyfriend in the second grade, bitch. So let me tell you how it went down. Let me just give you like a whole background, a whole, you know what I'm saying? Let me just give you the reruns. So, me and my best friend at the time, her name was Brittany. Brittany. Me and her known each other since, who gives a fuck? Just know we've been we've been best friends all the way till fifth grade. Basically, when we were left elementary, that was the end of our relationship. It was just a relationship in elementary. Plus, they lived in our neighborhood, not on the same street, but the same area. So, you know what I'm saying? When my mom went to work, she would drop us to a house next to their house. And her mom would drop us to school sometimes. So, I only remember one time, but I'm pretty sure it was like two times. Okay, but anyways, me and her were like best friends. Nah, she was a ho she was a freak, not a ho. She was a freak, yeah. So, um, I'm gonna just tell you about this incident. It doesn't have nothing to do with this story, but it just has something to do with me and her relationship and why she's a freak. So, so you guys know the edge of a chair, right? So at the, at the chair, like at the edge of the chair, you know the pointy part, basically at the chair, not the pointy part, like a chair, bitch. I'm talking about a chair. You know the the ending of the seat. She was at the edge of it and just rubbing it, like she was grinding on the seat, but like her hips, you know what I'm saying? And she was like, "Let me show you something. Like, I'm gonna teach you how to do this." And she was like, "This is how you do it." And she showed me this kind of grind on the chair at the edge. Really, it's like penetrating your your vagina. It's just, it felt good, you know what I'm saying? So, anyway, my little best friend was a freak, but it ain't no shame in the game because I already knew how to do that. You know, I would do that at home. It's basically dry humping a fucking chair. I would dry hump a bed. Confession. Because, bitch, I would tell the truth. I'm going to just tell the truth. You know what I'm saying? It's nasty or whatever. I, I did it, though. Different from me and you, I don't live a lie. I'd rather tell the truth than be honest. People gonna judge you regardless, but I don't give a fuck about what you gotta say about me. So, so yeah, I would dry her pillows, the bed, the side of the bed. Let me show you guys what I mean. So, you see the edge of this bed right here? Picture this was the chair. She was basically putting her ass in the basically like the her pussy right here and just rubbing it and I, i'm just telling you about that part but me dry humping the bed i'll dry hump the edge of the beds okay and the sides too okay horny kids so anyways um so anyways yeah me and her would talk we would talk she was, it was like, we ain't tell each other shit, but you know what I'm saying? We talk. Because we hung out a, a lot with each other, but we ain't had no deep conversation. So, it wasn't no deep conversation, but we were best friends because we knew each other. And we still had to see each other next year. Hey! So, now it's like, bitch, I know you from last year. I see you this year. You know what I'm saying? So, that's how we became best friends. But it was no intimate conversation or none of that. Okay, guys, wait. Okay, so I remember it was, I just killed a little fly. That's what I was telling you guys, hold on, because I knew I seen that shit. It was a bold fly, too. We had a lot of confidence to come up right behind my phone like that. That's why I asked that bitch killed by me. So, anyways. So, Brittany, I, I don't remember what day it was, but Brittany told me that she had a crush on um, Donald. We have a mutual crush. Me and her both liked the Donald. Little did she know. But you see, I was a crazy bitch. You remember back when I wrote on a wall, Donald, I forgot his last name, Donald. I put Donald plus Rebecca equals Donald, Donald, Rebecca something, his last name. Remember, it was on a wall. It's still in our, you know, we live in a new house, blah, blah, blah. But in our old house, I had Donald plus Bob, yeah, my name, and his last name. Everybody Okay. But anyways, I had his last name with mine. And it's so crazy because the relationship was even real. Let me get on to it, though. Okay, so you get the fact that me and her are both like the same guy, right? Right. 
but it was on no jealous stuff. I was just like, okay, all right. So you guys know I'm a little pussy, you know what I'm saying? I didn't want to let him know that I liked him, you know what I'm saying? But it was there, because you know when I give you that. <laughs> that look. <laughs> when I give you that look, nigga, you going to know that look. It's a difference between looking and that look. So I gave him that look. And he knew it, girl. So he knew it, boy. So... You know, I was a little pussy back then. I could do shit for myself. So, you know what I'm saying? It takes time, though. You know what I'm saying? You have to know how to stick up for yourself. Life lesson. But anyways, back then, um, I didn't want to let him know that I liked it. Then. I didn't really show too much signs. Um, yeah, whatever. Anyways. So, you know what I'm saying? I got my little sister to do the background work. And she went to go tell him that I liked him. And... Uh, it was this day after school, right? You know, when you're waiting to get picked up by your parents, car rider. There was a car rider section, bus section. We went to the car rider section, me, my brother, my sister. So, while we're waiting, he's also a car rider. I don't, he was a car rider that day. Oh, well. So, while we're waiting, he is there. And I said, to go do it. I said, oh, I'll just go do it because if I don't tell that, I'm going to change my mind. So I was just like, go ahead, go ahead, just do it, just do it. And I'm waiting for his response. And she was like, he asked you out. That's why I was like, okay, tell him yes. Who asked him out? Did he ask me out or did I ask him out? Basically, that's how it was. When you went to the relationship with somebody, like, um, you asked him out. I want to, Rebecca, do you want to go out with me? When you, okay, side note. Now, when you think about it, the grammar, do you want to go out? It's like, where are we going out to? You know what I'm saying? That's not how you say it, but that's what, you knew what, we knew what it meant when you said it. You know what I'm saying? Back then, but it's incorrect grammar. I don't like that. Like, don't say that. You, you sound stupid. You know what I'm saying? You're not a little kid. If you still use that, grow up. It's incorrect grammar. Or you Stop. It's, it's not, do you want to go out? Okay. Because where you going out to? Where you gonna take her? You know what I'm saying? You need a list of places. Now, do you want to go out? Do you want to go out where? When? Why? You know what I'm saying? With who? So, yeah. I said yes. Point blank of the story. So, you know what I'm saying? I'm excited. So, I'm just like, <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Dreams work. Dreams are work. Yeah, let me stop. But anyways, so... Yeah. Okay, me and him go out now. So, the next day. Oh, let me describe how Donald looked. Donald was a dreadhead. He had like a chip tooth. He had a tooth and a chip tooth, you know, some missing teeth. You know, we were kids. Still little we were little kids, you know what I'm saying? Teeth are getting you know, busted and growing back, you know what I'm saying? Blah, blah, whatever. So, the next day, now that we're official, Um, you know what I'm saying? I see him. He sees me. You know what I'm saying? Mind you. <laughs> mind you, like I said, I was a little pussy. So I was like, um, we ain't did shit together. I did not see him at school. We did not meet in the hallway. I did not go to the restaurant and go meet him nowhere. It was when I saw you, I saw you. That was it. I didn't, we never touched. We never kissed. We didn't do nothing with each other. All I did was look at him, bitch. I looked at him when I saw him. I looked at him. I didn't even look at him in the face when I said, yes, ho. I told my sister to go tell him. You know what I'm saying? Because I didn't want to go tell him. Now, I can do shit myself. I'm not going to, like... Anyways, that was... I'm talking about the past me. The Rebecca. So, you know what I'm saying? I just saw him the next day. You know what I'm saying? I made sure I look good. You know what I'm saying? Whatever showed my ass, basically. Because, bitch... Ain't know how to dress back then. I was looking tacky and ugly. Like, if I was to look at me back then, I'd be like, baby, you need some help. You need to throw all that shit out of your closet. Let me buy you some new shit. You know what I'm saying? But, at the time, I thought I was... Because I had more of a body than people in second grade. Like, a lot of people in my school were skinny. It was a lot of skinny bitches. I was a fat bitch, but I had ass. Or so I thought. So, anyways... So, um, 
yeah, I'm seeing him, you know, I'm making sure to move my hips, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, I was moving my hips, lips, hip, hips, left to right, making sure that he saw my ass. But anyways, years later, nobody ended it, but it's ended. Our relationship is over, done, completo. And I see him in the save a lot area passing by, and I was just like, that's Don. I was like, yo, that's him. And I'm so, bitch, I'm like, but I don't care. But I was like, yo, he look good. I don't know. I like dreadheads. Depends on how you look. But I, I don't mind people who got dreads on their hair. But either way, yeah, it was awkward. Because I was just like, my mans. If that was me, I would do so much more. But we weren't second grade, so what the fuck. But anyways, make sure you guys like, subscribe. I don't care too much for your comments. And you know what I'm saying? Always come back for more videos and make sure to spread positiveness and good vibes and always encourage others to do good things. And you know what I'm saying? Make somebody day. Make somebody smile. Blah, 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 blah. So, yeah, that was the story of my second grade little thing thing. And you. Yeah, it was not a relationship. We were in a relationship, but it wasn't a relationship. That was funny, though, because. I was really excited to have my first boyfriend, but bitch, he was just a friend. Yeah, that's it. But make sure you guys like and subscribe, you know, subscribe for more videos because I'm always keep doing shit, bitch. And watch my other story times. Weirdo. <laughs> that's my sister, y'all, at the door who keeps opening up the door. Is it a ghost? I'm just kidding now. I'm trying to see my lips actually. Hold up. I ain't gonna get too close to the camera. Okay. It's night time. I'm gonna finish doing what I need to do.